What's up guys, Game Fiend Fiend of All Games here and on this uh, history of Guns with Game Fiend we're going to be talking about the Scars. Yes, there are two versions of the Scars and Modern Warfare 2 had the Scar H which stood for Heavy and in this game uh, they put the Scar L which stands for Light. Uh, let me give you a little info on this gun. It's the Specials Operation Forces Combat Assault Rifle or in lame's terms the Scar is a mod is a mod dual rifle made by FN Arsenal for the United States Special Operations Command SOCOM to satisfy the requirements of the SCAR competition the family of rifles consists of two main types the SCAR L which stands for light is chambered in a 5.56 times 45 millimeter nano cartridge and the SCAR heavy fires a 7.62 times 51 millimeter nano both are available in long barrel and close barrel quarter and close quarters combat variants. The FN SCAR systems complete low rate initial production testing in June of 2007. After some relays, after some delays, the first rifles began issued to operational units in April 2009. And a battle ton of the US 75 75th Ranger Regiment was the first large unit deployed into combat with 600 of the rifles in 2009. The U.S. Special Operations Command has currently canceled their purchases of the MK-16, SCAR, L, and are planning to remove the rifle from their inventory by 2013. However, they plan to purchase the 5.56 millimeter conversion kits for the MK-17, supplementing the loss from the MK-16. Um, now some side facts on both guns. Uh, place of place of origin is Belgium and United States. Uh, it's currently in service. It's been in service since 2009 to present. Uh, wars. It's currently being used now in Afghanistan. Uh, variants. You have the Scar L and Scar H, which are mods of the MK16, MK17. Um, weight. The weight of the Scar L is three. Oh, excuse me, is 6.7 pounds. Short and standard, it's 7.3 pounds. And long, it's 7.7 pounds. The Scar H, short and standard, are both 7.9 pounds. And the Scar Long is 8.2 pounds. Um, the cartridges, well, I went over the cartridges in the description, but that's pretty much uh, sums it up on the facts of this gun. Um, my thoughts on the gun, how it is in the game, it works very, very well. It works great with a silencer. I, hi I highly notice the damage um, fall off from distance of range when you use a silencer. It, it doesn't feel like it loses any damage over range with a silencer. Well, that's how it feels to me. Um, speaking of range, effective range on the Scar L is 300 meters and the Scar Heavy, the Scar Heavy is 300 meters as well. So they both have a range of 300 meters. Um, the feed system that the L uses, it uses a, a snag box magazine, and the SCAR H uses a 20 round box magazine. That explains why in Modern Warfare 2, it only had um, 20 bullets, but the bullets were, were stronger. And then the light version has more bullets, but the bullets are weaker. Um, would, I, would I ever buy this gun in real life? Yes, I probably would if I could afford it. And it's an American... It's an American assault rifle, so hopefully there there probably is a, um, a civilian version out in the gun. But anyway, um, that wraps this up on history with uh, with gate history with guns with game fiend. Uh, I'm out of here, guys. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.